The top plate has been unscrewed and I can now access the internals of the drive. The results are rather interesting. Uh, first of all, from that bullet hole here, that was the only fragment of the bullet to be recovered. When I take the top plate off, you'll see what I'm talking about. We have full penetration of a dual platter drive. Those are two platters. So we've got two thin steel platters, a heavy steel top case, and a mild steel frame. We have a complete platter penetration on this side as well. And what I thought was most amazing is that the bullet actually still, after penetrating the top steel top plate, had enough energy to bend the heavy steel frame surrounding the voice coil magnet that is probably one of the toughest parts of the drive. The right here is one of the toughest parts of the drive to shoot. A uh, bullet has very difficulty, very difficult getting through either here or through here the platter motor. But as you can see right here, this was all three rounds penetrated and they penetrated after clearing, after actually hitting some pretty heavy duty obstructions. And that was just with the blade basic, the CCI 22 Maxi Mag, which has a standard jacketed hollow point bullet. Um, also, if you notice, the size of the entry holes on the drive are at least, I would say, that's, that's definitely beyond a 22 caliber. That's, I'd say, closer to a 30 caliber entry hole. Um, the exit hole, hard to tell because we're just dealing with a drive that will fragment when you shoot it. But uh, all in all, very, very impressive results. And let's get another look inside the drive because I just think that's cool. Uh, we have the hard drive platters. This is where the data would be stored. Then you have the read-write heads. These are what actually read the data off the drive. Normally on a non-shot drive, these heads can skitter back and forth. And this voice coil magnet here contains an exceptionally powerful neodymium magnet. So needless to say, after I finish this video, I'm going to put the top plate back on. There's still plenty of shootable area on it. I'm going to try a few different rounds. Then I'm going to harvest the voice coil magnets because those are just fun. Oh, looks like we found another fragment of the bullet that came out from under the drive. That's all that was recovered. Everything else, the bullet must have destructed, completely fragmented when it hit the drive.